title of your book. It's Nancy Pelosi and the Lessons of Power. The lessons of power are presumably those that she drew from her father, and to some extent her grandfather and her mother, uh, and those that she's picked up along the way. Um, th th it's not a book where there are sort of 12 lessons of power in this <laughs> at the end, but if you were to say what the, the, the key lessons of power that Nancy Pelosi has drawn and has deployed, what would they be? So I'll answer that question, but first let me talk about the title, if you don't mind, for just a moment. So the first title, when I <clears throat> signed the contract with 12 books for this book, the title was Madam Speaker, Nancy Pelosi, and the Ark of Power, because she gained power and lost it. I thought Ark would be a nice word. And then midway through, we changed the title to be Madam Speaker, Nancy Pelosi, and the Tests of Power, because she had been tested uh, in difficult situations uh, that required power. But by the time we published the book, it had become Madam Speaker Nancy Pelosi and the lessons of power. And that was because she applied the lessons she learned in Baltimore and Little Italy from her father, the mayor, and from her mother uh, for the rest of her life. She is not, she is a San Francisco liberal, but she is also a Baltimore Paul. So you really saw that reflected even in the title of the book. And if you think about the lessons of power, that she has applied through her life. She has a number one lesson of power, kind of prime directive that she has told any number of politicians and would-be politicians who have come to her for advice. And that is, nobody is going to give you power. You have to seize it. That was a lesson from her father's life. He had challenged a Democratic incumbent for the in the Democratic primary for the House election and won. That was a that was a lesson that she applied in her own life when she mounted what was in effect an insurgent campaign for the Democratic leadership, upending the uh, Democratic establishment, which by the way was all male, and getting herself on a path to becoming Speaker of the House. Hachette.